Home is where the art is. That is our slogan. There's no rules to art. Art is the freedom to create whatever you want to and whatever your mind desires. Whatever you can create is art. We're always going to have art in, in every society, so that's also important to cultivate that with the kids. It enriches our life, personal lives, and our community as well. Part of our community is doing things a little bit different, having a lot of fun. We like to get really creative, and our students aren't afraid to put themselves out there. There's a lot of movement. There's a lot going on, uh, and there's a lot of a lot happening. But at the same time, there's a lot of learning in the process. Renaissance High School for the Arts is a safe haven for young artists to have an opportunity to expand their talents based on whatever level that they come in with. We welcome it, we try to nourish it, and to take them to the next level. Qualities I observe in Renaissance students and a student who would like to come here to Renaissance definitely needs to be creative, they need to be a risk taker, they need to be willing to take feedback and grow from it. The culture here is all about creativity um, and empowering students to tap into that creativity. I believe that when we're born, we all have that creativity, but what we provide are the skills necessary to implement that creativity. The pathways at Renaissance that are available are the visual and performing arts. So in the visual arts, we offer drawing and painting, three-dimensional art, costume design, and digital art. And then in the performing arts, we offer a whole range of classes in theater, music, both instrumental and vocal, dance, and technical theater. Performance art is a way for a lot of students to be able to tap into different parts of themselves that sometimes they might not always want to get into, or different like things going on in their life. And it's a way for them to explore that in a way and really get in touch with themselves and their feelings and be able to present that to others. I am in love with 3D art. I'm in love with sculpture. I love designing things out of wire. It is a just release of creative energy. It's so amazing to be able to just create something with your hands and have it stand in front of you. Arts education is good for anyone, no matter what career you're going to end up having. Uh, it teaches you discipline, self-discipline, self-motivation, organizational skills. To put an entire portfolio together takes an enormous amount of organization and dedication and follow through. When you walk into this campus, you'll hear vocal musicians singing, which you know resonates down the hall, or you hear um, jazz band jamming. You see students like working with each other. You see teachers talking with students on a first name basis because we know our students pretty well. There you see like a positive vibe. We have a pretty welcoming atmosphere, a pretty progressive atmosphere. Um, you see students supporting each other. A lot of people at Renaissance are very dedicated in their art, and I feel like that rubs off on their schoolwork as well because we know from practicing things multiple times, you gotta keep working at it and it can always get better. And so we know that applies also to our academics. And so we try to like make it better and keep working at it if we know we're not strong in something. We're serious about our um, academics just as much as our art. You see it in the teacher's passion. I think you see it in the students who come here because this is 100% school of choice. When they choose to come here, it's because they are inspired. They do have that intrinsic want or need to succeed. Arts are greatly incorporated into our academics here, and I think that's so important, especially for artists, because it keeps us interested in our academic classes. And in Spanish right now, we're making children's books that involve drawing and writing, and I think being able to put that creative idea and creative freedom into academics keeps people interested in their academic classes. In science class, we work with the microscope a lot in hands lens and look at plant cells, animal cells, and students work on using their observational skills to create microscopic drawings. We have multiple AP classes that all students can take starting in 10th grade up to 12th grade. We have so many people from different backgrounds, different arts, different interests. Working with a big group of people all trying to go for the same goal, working on the same project is a really beneficial learning experience. When you get here, you will realize that everyone here is better than you at something. And over these next four years, you will realize that even though they might be better at you in some aspect, you still have your own amazing qualities that will stand out. Eventually, you'll learn to be less intimidated by the kid who can draw a still life incredibly realistically or who can play like the drums like as if he wasn't queen.
We just had a $40 million renovation. Renaissance means rebirth, and that's basically what we're going through right now. Renaissance is located in the Arts District in Long Beach, and what's really cool and unique about that is that our students have the opportunity to go off campus and interact with our community members. Long Beach really has a wonderfully rich arts community. These students are artists already. When they're in the school, they are a working artist. They are producing work. They are on stage. They are putting together portfolios. They have work up at the Long Beach Museum of Art. We get a lot more like one-on-one -on -one individual attention because we are such a small school, which is really nice. And you get to know your teachers and they actually know you. One of the allures of the school is that it is so small that we see the same students for four years. We have a staff of 20, 20 plus teachers, uh, 500 students. So over the years, the familiarity, it creates a sense of safety for all types of students uh, from all different communities. You can't be creative unless you feel safe. You can't be ready to perform unless you feel safe. So the safer you feel, the more creative you can be. I just knew the school was meant for me. And when I came here, like, I was right. Like, this is where I want to be. Like, I want to focus on the arts. I love it here. Like, I love the staff. I love the students here. I love everything the school promotes for us kids and just helps us with, like, our future. I'm just really lucky and happy to be here as a student. I think if you're trying to get out of your shell and get more into your art and know who you are, this, this is a perfect school.